everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jen, I post videos twice a week. And today's video, I'm going to take you to the range with me because I am in the process of moving out. So I just want to see what good bits that they have in. The video will probably be a voiceover because it's so hard to talk with a mask on and be heard. So yeah, just let you know that. So yeah, that is the video. So I hope you enjoy and please don't forget to like and subscribe. So starting at the entrance, I saw these gorgeous beauty boxes, great for holding makeup in. They had bigger ones and smaller ones with the silver glitter along the front. I thought these would look really nice in a dressing room. They had so many little home decor bits to put on a fireplace or on a mantle. And they had lots of reflective candle holders and they had so many nice colours of these as well. I even found this Christmas tree light and I was so tempted to buy it, but it's just a bit too early. We're only in August. They had lots of tea light holders and these candle holders looked absolutely stunning. I thought that they looked so, so expensive and such a great price. £7 for most of them. Then moving on to a blush pink range, they had lots of flowers more tea light holders of different patterns and prints they also had these big holders i'm not sure what you put in them maybe a candle but those were really big you could also add these furniture knobs that could help dress up anything if you want to upcycle a bit of furniture that would help it make a lot more bougie and more expensive they had a lot of reflective shiny decor items and I absolutely love the copper and rose gold colours. I love this clock here and it was so inexpensive. Only $8.99. Love that price. I love this little pink stool that I found and they also had lots of cute little drawers. I love this little set here for $14.99 and they had a smaller set, great for putting jewellery in or little hair clips and I love this little nightstand I think it was and that was only $17.99 and I love the pr print on it. The ottoman here, again £25, looks really expensive, definitely put that in a dressing room or just to put your feet on. They had so many lovely little trinket boxes and I love this little velvet stool but it is like very low to the ground but I think that was £15. I love all these flowers, these was actually in the bridal range but yeah you can use them for anything I think. I love the lighting section in the range. I think it's so nice. I love this light here at the bottom. It was £25. How gorgeous is this little Cinderella ball light? It was a bit expensive, but I thought it was so nice. And they have so many nice white and copper lamps. I had to include this little sausage dog. I thought it was so cute. I just love sausage dogs. And they had lots of, again, lots of plants, ornaments. I love this globe here for $9.99. I just went into TK Maxx and they actually sell, sell similar ones for $25. So definitely go to the range if you're looking for a really nice decor item like that. These Buddha heads were so cheap as well and they were actually really big. Another little Dash One calendar I had to include. And then there was this big vase, I think it was. Then moving on to the furniture, I included a few bits, but they didn't have too much in there. But they have lots of storage cube holders and they also have single storage cubes you can buy. So you can add different colours to match the theme of your room, which I think is really nice. And they're only a few pounds, which again, very, very cheap. Then they have some Ottomans. So the Ottomans weren't too expensive either. I think they were about £20 and some were on sale. So just depending on what you're looking for, they have lots to choose from. I also love like the beds and how they lay out the rooms. I think that there wasn't too much going on, but it was nice and minimal and it helps you think if, especially if you're moving out, like what your house could look like. And it has so much 
little bits of cabinets, storage and a few couches but not an excessive amount. I love this little dining table and that was actually on sale for £120. Really, really cheap, especially if you are looking to move out. They had so many nice chairs and stools for kitchen worktops and yeah, they look so nice. So I had to include this little Halloween section. I am so over summer at the minute and I love anything autumn, Halloween, Christmas and they only had a small section so far but they were still putting stuff out but I think some of them of the decorations just look so nice like they have a few little fairy lights here they're only three pounds but are great for if you're having a party it's just a really really cheap decoration idea that can actually make your house look really spooky they also have these big lanterns with candles in they do have some cheaper stuff that isn't as nice but I love all the lights that they have and this eyeball light was very different. I've never seen anything like that before. They also have lots of tinsel items. I'm not a huge fan of tinsel at Halloween. I know it's more of a new thing that's come into play at the minute, but I definitely think tinsel is only for Christmas and I'd never buy anything tinsel for Halloween. I love this little haunted light up house. Seven pounds, so nice and so nice of a price. And then they had lots of decorative things for 99p. They had some cotton webs that you could buy and they weren't your fluffy type, they were more sturdy and it was in a roll which was actually really good as well. So that's the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye!